Now, so that story was a big story. Like I said, it wasn't as big in Western media as it should have been. There wasn't an onus put on it, but it's a super important story and it really shocked the conscience of the world. So guess what? The IDF felt compelled to, I guess, do some sort of uh, after the fact um, clean up propaganda. And so now they come out and say, it's unbelievable. IDF says it found concealed weapons within the baby ward of Kamal al Adwan Hospital in northern Gaza, specifically in the incubators meant for the care of premature infants. So in other words, oh, did we kill some premature babies? Oh, well, I guess you got to blame Hamas because they were hiding weapons in the incubators. That's what this is. I've never seen a government be this bad at propaganda. I'm sorry, but the Israeli government makes the U.S. government look like Michael Jordan when it comes to propaganda. So for everybody who's just listening to this podcast dial and now playing the video of them going in, and it's like, they're, they're like undoing screws in the incubators and they're reaching in there and they're like, look, guns, Hamas weapons were found in here. Now, look, I'll ask you, does this make, does this pass the smell test? Like, if you're in Hamas, you're going to want to have guns readily accessible. You're not going to want to have them where you need to break out a screwdriver or a wrench and undo an incubator and take out the gun, which is then also in a plastic bag on top of that. That makes absolutely no sense. This is the worst propaganda I've ever seen. And you know what scares me? It scares me that there are some people who will see this and just totally swallow it hook, line, and sinker and think it's real. Like, that is a level of dense or a level of bias I cannot comprehend. You're a stage five dumbass.